The main learning objectives for this module is to give you an overview of the ACC web client and show you how to access it from the web browser. The web client is a simplified version of the client software that allows you to access any Vigilon server connected on your network. You can access the web client from any web browser with access to your local network, and you do not need to install the client software to access the web client. To access the web client, you need to know the IP address and port number of the server you want to connect to. To find the server's IP address, you can ask your system administrator or you can access the server directly. To access the server to find the IP address, you can do so either using the client software or through the server's command prompt. To find the server's IP address through the client software, open the server setup dialog box in the client software. Right click the server from the system explorer, then select setup. In the server setup dialog box, copy the IP address displayed in the server description. You will also need the server's port number, which you can either find via the server's admin tool or by asking your system administrator. To access the admin tool from the server, perform one of the following. From the Windows Start menu, select Programs, Avigilon, Avigilon Control Center Server, Avigilon Control Center Server Admin Tool. Double click the Admin Tool shortcut on the desktop, or double click the Avigilon Control Center icon on the system tray. When the Admin Tool appears, select the Settings tab. In the Settings tab, click Network. When the Network dialog box appears, copy down the number displayed in the Web Browser Access area. Now that you have the server's IP address and port number, you can access the server through the web client. Open your copy of the Internet Explorer web browser. Be aware that the web client is only compatible with Internet Explorer. In the address bar, enter http colon slash slash the server IP address colon and the port number, like the example displayed. If this is your first time accessing the web client, you'll be prompted to install the required browser plugins. When the web client finishes loading, you will see this login page. Enter your Vigilon Control Center login information and click Login. Once you're logged in, the web client displays. The web client works in much the same way as the client software, but be aware that you can only access one server at a time. Thank you for your attention. You should now have a general understanding of the Vigilon Control Center web client and how to access it from your web browser.